we have seen sunny days. Not a lot of rain no. out there these last few days either. Now, because of all this dry weather, city officials in Sevierville and Gatlinburg issuing an open burn ban until further notice. Sevier County on high alert right now, waiting for an official call from the Department of Forestry in regards to open burning. New at 5, WAT6 on your side reporter Kirsty Crawford tells us what city leaders and firefighters want everybody to know. It's hot and dry, barely any rain, if any, expected. The drought-like conditions bring out concerns for firefighters like Sevierville Fire Chief Matt Henderson. There's two ponds that I drive by every day, uh, and I just notice them, and I know where those levels were in 2016, and I know where they are today. So uh, visual indicators and then uh, looking at, at the forecast. Henderson noticing other visual indicators, such as dry grass, stronger wind gusts, saying the conditions are very similar to the conditions leading up to the 2016 wildfires. He says issuing an open burn ban limits the chance of prescribed burns or campfires from getting out of hand and spreading. Any type of open burning won't be allowed for now, except for those wanting to make s'mores. You can use a grill or you can have a, a pit type fire to cook. Uh, if you were at a campground, we, we're still going to let those take place. The Sevierville Fire Chief also says that smokers need to be careful during this time. Improperly discarding cigarette butts during an open burn ban uh, can lead to a brush fire. Reporting in Sevierville, Kirsty Crawford, WATE6 on your side. Again, everyone, as we said, Sevier County is on a high alert right now for open burning. Now, unlike city governments, the county has to get approval from the state to issue an open burn ban.